heritage committee members they um they selected these uh recipients who were um you know uh doing major restoration work or renovation work and the development of properties some of them were in really poor condition and then um they put in um, you know structural architectural efforts into making it a uh, viable development or uh, continuing use of a uh, heritage property that is well maintained and well preserved and um, some of the properties have been given a new life so um, for example for example uh, the property at 1008 Drulat Road uh, which is now um, the tenant is the city cycler building and we have break control solution at 1785 Walker Road. Um, it's, it's in a streamlined um, Art Deco style building. And then we also have um, the Hiram Walker Pesh Island Bridge Restoration, which was, you know, in Hiram Walker's era, and the bridge was constructed to support the summer residents of Hiram Walker. And we have a private property owner uh, of uh, 225 Giles Below West, the Westgate House which is in colonial revival style and um, the owner took painstaking efforts to make sure that the clay tower roof could be kept and that's very unique to um, Windsor. And lastly, we have the Mackenzie Hall Restoration Project, which was a major work to um, just back point, repoint, um, and repoint the brakes and um, the stones, sorry, the stones, and <laughs> redo, um, a lot of the work that is needed to keep the building for the however many hundreds of years to come. So um, we're excited to just be able to support and honor um, all the work that has been done to help preserve our um, heritage his and heritage and history for years to come.